Hey guys, so today I'm here with another video. Um, a while back I made a video called Plans for 2017 and I said how I was like moving myself from like over there to over here and I've done that now. Uh, I did do it for a video but then all the files just deleted themselves and went. Um, this is the first time me like vlogging like this. Don't have a screen so I don't know if it's in focus so and if I have auto focus on it does this like weird jumping thing. So if I go out of focus then I'm sorry if I'm gonna do a bit of auto focusing. But yeah, my arm's already aching. Um but yeah today, um with super fast delivery, literally what day is it on now? Tuesday today. So on Sunday we ordered my keyboard and that because I have decided that in this corner now where my setup was, because um, like my setup's here now, as you can see, oh God. <clears throat> um, I'm gonna make like a like a music kind of corner. I kind of said that weird, but well. Um, so you can see I have two guitars there at the minute, and I've taken everything off the walls, like these boards that were on there. Yeah, you, if you're not seeing any of my gear and setup videos, then you'll know what it used to look like. Um, but you can see it's like really empty now. Um, in other videos, it's I'm just watching this back and I'm like, why did I say video? I think it's because I was talking about like the video, like gaming style video. Um, but instead of video, I meant to say things. So, another thing or whatever. Um, I don't know why I said video, it's a bit weird. It's just been like completely cluttered, everything in there. But we were just like at a car boot sale and sold a lot of my like old toys kind of thing. So um, yeah, um, I ordered <coughs> a new keyboard. I do have a keyboard. It's under my sofa, but it's a really old one. So I ordered a new keyboard, and the bundle was like keyboard, stand, and chair, and headphones. But there's no box for the headphones. As you can see, we just got the keyboard box, the stand box, and that box but no headphone box um, like because I wasn't in when it came no one was in it had to be left with a neighbour and I asked her like um, was, is there not another box um, and she was like saying no but I'm just going to have to like uh, contact them because that was in the bundle so I should be getting it Unless it's in like one of them boxes when I was thinking that's the Yamaha box, that's the keyboard box and the headphones are the gear for music box, that's the website that I got it off but they don't look like they'd be in that box or in that box so I was like wondering like where they could be so uh, I'm just gonna unbox it all, set it up and do a review basically so uh, yeah I'll see you when I've Got all this in because my arm's really aching you now. <laughs> right, so um, first thing we've got the chair. Um, now I'm a bit like disappointed in how the box is. I'm just like fuck it. Now. Uh, a bit disappointed in how the box is. Let me turn this light on as well. <laughs> Get a better lighting option. Um, you can see on the back there, the stand is actually, well, the chair is actually coming through the box and you can see how like, battered it is on the side here. Um, but, I think what they've done is to get it here, like, so quickly, <laughs> they've been throwing it around, but, um, yeah, it's not even standing up. Let me just, like, auto focus. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to open it and see if it works. It better be like fine. <clears throat> right. Okay, I can pull it out. Oh, okay, right. <laughs> oh wow. Fuck oh, no. So to save the packaging, which is actually good. They um, put it in with it, so no separate box. Good thing about um, this as well. Let me just put that there. I need to make sure that this is all in focus. 
the good thing about um, getting off gear for music I didn't really bother, like, care about the headphones because they are, you can tell, like, the really cheap headphones. <clears throat> but, um, this cable feels so weird. But it comes with a, um, oops. this adapter. So it's like, what is it now? I can't remember the size of that, but you got your normal, like, headphone jack and it, like, turns it into that because that's all that um the keyboard can have so you can't plug that in but you could plug that into like your phone or anything i do already have one of them but it's um like not a very good one compared to that as you can see that and that <laughs> so uh, that's good so yeah oh, i'm glad that the headphones are in there <laughs> um so and i've got the rest of the chair which i can't even pull out Okay, that's good. It literally only folds up. <laughs> I gotta make sure this is all in focus. Put it in also focus. Tell me about all the the jumpy noise though. I'm using my um like I'm gonna put this here so like Fox is it? Um, I didn't want to like use my GoPro um because like. Well, I just didn't, and then I didn't want to use my phone because that's like low on, um, low on battery and low on storage. Um, so I decided to use my like proper camera, which I've not used in a while. <laughs> well, this looks kind of simple. Take this off. Looks like the instructions are on like the back of it. So you just like put the camera in focus. So you just like put it down and then oh, it just looks like you put this in here. And then twist this up so that it doesn't like slide away. That's the stand. I'm looking at the wrong thing. <laughs> Look at the chair, it would help. Fully collapsible, comfortable, padded top. It's alright. Um, suitable for keyboard, yep. <clears throat> height adjustment. Yeah, there's a height adjustment thing there. I'm just gonna have to wait till I get the actual like stand up um, to do the adjusting. Alright, so that shouldn't come out of there now. So it stays together, as you can see. I'm gonna sit on it, which hopefully doesn't collapse. The fuck was that? Oh, um, one of my lights has just gone out. <laughs> I don't even know if you saw that flash on the um, camera then, but uh, yeah, a bulb has just gone out. <laughs> uh, at least there's one over there and not over here, because then there'd be no light over here. But you can see, you can sit on it, and I'm not like falling off, so. That's fine. The height adjustment just looks like you twist this, undo it, and um, take it out, and then like real align the holes, and then yeah. So uh, chairs. That's actually quite nice. I've literally got no room in here. <laughs> how tidy it was before my room, and like how tidy it is now. <laughs> Uh, my battery is getting low, so um, I'm going to stop it now and then do the stand. I've got another battery on charge here, um, so yeah, I'll be back to do the stand. So, this is the um, the stand now. It's just one of the X-Frame stands. I'm hoping that it doesn't collapse because that keyboard is a £300 keyboard. And I'm hoping that these aren't cheap stands because the bundle was cheap um, to say what it came with. But I'm hoping that they just didn't throw in a cheap stand. It is one of their own. But yeah, I, st I still just thought that it's fine. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, these stands are literally just the gear for music stands. 
<clears throat> if you guys wanna um, get anything, get in, like music stuff, go for music as the players. I'm saying that now, but hopefully I'll, what I'm saying the opposite later when it all collapses. But um, I ordered my, uh, I got my DJ deck off there as well. My mixing deck. And that's still working like perfectly fine today. And the service is really good on it and that. And you can see this came in two days and this was the standard shipping. Decent. It just literally looks like it's a random uh, extra and they just put their own sticker on it. Oh. Well, there's the adjustable. You just, like... I need to make sure this is in focus. It's probably not been in focus this whole time. You literally just have to pull this out and then... Easier said than done. Pull it out and then twist it. <sighs> twist, there we go. And put it in whichever hole you want. That's for the height. All right, would you shut up now, camera? Focus. <clears throat> right now, I'm gonna get the uh, the rest of it. This one's got a bit more to do with it, but once it's all together, you can just fold it and it goes straight down. All right, nothing else in that box. <clears throat> right, so we've got you know, I'd just go for the rip on the bottom if can't be bothered with knots. Right, so it looks like this is probably the the I don't think I think they're both the exact same. Just one of them's got the um stuff in it to attach it all. What I can see so far is that um, in the little bag of screws and that, there's the Allen key, so you can um, build it straight away. You don't need your own tool, so that's a good thing. There goes the Allen key. And it looks like it's just literally as simple as putting, sliding them onto it. Please be in focus. So it's just as easy as sliding them onto it and then screwing the bolt into it. So it looks like it just... I've got a feeling it goes that way because the bolt had got into the dent. You probably can't even see this. Let me just... So you can see it's got the dent in the top there if you can. I think that's where the ball goes into. That, the only thing is there's no instructions in it, but I think they're that like, self-explanatory that you don't need it's instructions. But it would go in that way, you can see. It just makes it more flush. Can, like hand screw it in but then it's just best to tighten it especially when it's going to be holding some uh, like keyboard you want it tight as you can get it not too tight so there we go we've got one in uh. just really put these in my pocket Mm -hmm. I'll be back when I put all these in. <clears throat> right, um, now this is where this stand should have had instructions in it because um, I didn't notice this, I just thought they were all the same length, but you can see how them are completely different lengths and this has like different 
um, like rubber bits on the end. It's got like a little bit in it, and this one's just like completely round. Um, you can also see that it wobbles, but I think that's the floor. <laughs> But I don't know whether this bit goes on the floor, the longer one, or if it's the shorter one. I would think it's the longer one so it keeps it on, but then keyboards aren't really that wide. Um, and you want all the rubber bit to be on the keyboard. So, um, I'm just wondering now. I'm just going to put on, put them back on because I just took them off to like measure it. But I'm going to put them back on, and then I'll get the keyboard out, put it on, and then, like, see which side's best. Because I don't know which side is. I'm going to have to do some about the wobble, though. Um, but, yeah. Um, I'll be back when I put them back on. And I've got the keyboard box in here. Oh, fuck. Right, yeah, this is a big box. Here's the keyboard. The keyboard better not be this long because it's going here. And I've also got a guitar stand to go to the end, like a rack kind of thing. Um, if it is that long, then I'm gonna have to make sure, like, hope that the guitar stand doesn't go past there because then I can put the keyboard right across that wall. But, whew. Um, that's taken out with that. <coughs> Let me take you off the tripod. Um, so this is the keyboard. It's a uh, Yamaha P45. Don't know what the B is for, but it's a P45. I have played on this and bro, I have played on this and tried it in a um, music shop. So um, I really like it. So uh, yeah. Let's uh, get this open. I have not a lot of room, but I'm gonna do this. Them two bags are like rubbish bags because <laughs> I've had a lot of um, like cardboard and normal rubbish whilst I've been clearing this room out. So uh, I'm gonna move you back. So yeah, let's uh, get into this box. <coughs> right, I've swapped batteries again because uh, that one was flashing red. So, uh, we're back now, a new battery. I, I didn't actually realise that the batteries would be dead. <laughs> Thought they'd be fine, but I haven't used this camera in a while. Uh, right. Towards yourself, by the way, with scissors. <laughs> I'm just being stupid. No, that's how you do it. <laughs> right, we're in. Uh, this cardboard's so thick. Make sure you can see all this. So this is the uh, music rest. This is everything that comes with this uh, keyboard, by the way. I didn't actually know everything that came with it. <laughs> so when I was looking at bundles and I saw that it didn't come with a sustain pedal, like it didn't have it in the picture or in the description, I was like, I'm not getting it. <laughs> but I found the cheapest bundle, which was from um, Gear for Music. Um, so yeah. Yeah, if you want this keyboard and all this stuff, really good bundle. It's only £339, which sounds a lot, but the keyboard's 300 by itself. Them stands are usually like 10 quid, so is the chair. So, and then the headphones, they'll be like, I don't know, 
but still a good bundle. So I've got the instructions here. The owner's manual, you probably can't even see this. <coughs> owner's manual, and this is the product ID. Uh, so this is just going to tell you every, all the settings on it um, and everything about it. This lighting looks really bad through this camera. Let me turn you brighter. I don't even know if that's going brighter or darker. I feel like it's going dark. It's not really going brighter. I actually can't tell. There we go, that's brighter. <laughs> right, now you're in focus. So we got the music stand, rest thing, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I hate polystyrene because it gets everywhere. <laughs> but it keeps everything secure, which is the main thing. Right, um, let's get this out now. <laughs> oh my god, it's all right. Uh, right, I don't see the sustain pedal anywhere. I'm worrying. This is so heavy. I'm worrying still. There it is. I did also forget about the power brick as well. <laughs> Nearly had to be somewhere. Right, oh god. Taking it out with me this. Right, let me get this so you can see it. Just about. Right. Here's the keyboard. Now I've got to put it onto the stand and see if it'll um, like which way I need the stand. So let me get you up. Zoom in. I'm not doing a very good job of this video. Would be good if someone else was here, but you know. All oh, the keys are so nice. I actually don't realise how heavy this thing is. <sighs> right. It's looking like we'll need the smaller side, but I'm still just going to put it on the sink. Go on, drop it. I'm definitely going to need the smaller side. <laughs> oh, just <sighs> breathe a second. <laughs> oh. At least get these boxes out now. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna get rid of these boxes and I'll be back. <laughs> <clears throat> right, well, it's all set up now. Um, you have to put the longer bits on top and the short ones on the bottom. It just worked out better. Um, I do have a bit of a wobble on it. Uh, I don't know why. I think it's through the stand. Um, just because the whole bottom, like, underneath the keyboard is completely flat. So, I don't know why it's doing that. But, um, I'm just going to plug it in now and make sure it works. Um, come on. Don't want to force it and break. <laughs> There's the plug. Let me make sure this is in focus. It's looking a bit bright now. Stand 
stem pedals in. That's just here. Yeah. All right, we're all ready now. I saw them cables a lot of the time. Um, pedal feels fine. It's just a little light. Yeah, a little pedal. Right. I move you in now. Right, so I've got the power button here. It's on. Right, my car just got full. I don't know when it cut out, but as you can see, it's on. And, um, I've got the volume on, and you can hear. It works. Um, you can see it's got lots of different functions. Um, let me just do. That's as far as it'll zoom in. <clears throat> so if you hold down the function button, um, you got the first uh, piano. So I guess that's just normal piano. And then you got this one. Normal piano again. I don't actually know what the difference is. I can't hear a difference now. Uh, then we've got electric piano. And the second electric piano. I can hear a difference there as well. We've got organ. And the other organ. Uh, strings. And two harpsichords. Can't really hear a difference there. <laughs> and we've got a vibraphone. <laughs> so, uh, then we're on the mode. Um, and you can see down here, down here, I have the pedal. Um, and you can see it's working, so. So, uh, that's uh, working perfectly fine, and uh, yeah, I'm just going to play a bit on it, <clears throat> I'm going to play some like old songs that I know, they're like old pop kind of songs, um, but they're still good, because <laughs> I've not really played keyboard in a while, um, I'm going to put it out over here actually, I've never actually played <laughs> um, any instrument for um, YouTube before. So, uh, this is gonna be the first time. <laughs> I have actually played a little bit on it already, but it's actually a really, really nice um, keyboard. A bit dusty there. Um, so, yeah, I'm gonna play it now. I'm not gonna make like loads of mistakes now. <laughs> That's what I was supposed to do at the end, but you know, didn't really work. Another thing that I didn't actually show was that it's got a metronome on it. And you can uh, set it. I don't know what them things do. 
just going to doing nothing at the minute. Actually, I think I know what it is now. Okay, I don't actually know what these numbers are. <laughs> There's loads of numbers across the back, I don't know what it is, I'm just going to leave it on default. Uh, but you can change the beat here. So when the. Uh, And that's on the eighth beat, but I just keep it on four. But you can have zero as well, so you can just have a single metronome. And you can change the volume of the metronome as well here. I like this noise that it makes when um, you're clicking the functions. Um, but I'm just going to leave that on four. That's why I have it on. But um, I don't need that on at the minute, so uh, yeah, I'll do another song. I did add, add like a little twist to that. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I did add the. Uh, um, but <laughs> if you want to play normally, I don't even think I was that in it. Can't be playing now. Yeah, I think it doesn't even have that, and I just added in the. See, it's wobbling a lot, but I'm fine with that. It's working perfectly fine, which is good. Um, what else? This one yet. <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> The SD card that I'm using here um, ran out as well, um, so yeah, that's why it just cut out there. I was kind of failing a lot in that because I haven't played that one in ages, so I just put in like the best bits of me playing it there. Um, but yeah, my SD card did run out, um, so yeah. So guys, um, I'm doing this outro on my phone because every card on my camera um, is full. <clears throat> I do need to go through them and see what's on there. Um, but 
yeah, I've just tested the headphones and they're alright, you know, like, they're just like any cheap headphones. Um, they sound like a bit muffly, but they're just fine for cheap headphones. Um, it doesn't come through the speakers when you have the headphones in. And um, yeah, now what I'm going to try is uh, plugging it into my computer. If it probably won't reach um, because I don't have a long enough cable. Um, so I don't know, I'm going to try that. So for recording, um, I need to have a look for longer USB cables for that. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to outro this video now. This keyboard is really, really good. Um, <clears throat> this, this, so this is like a review. Because I've just played it. I don't know, I think there's only like two songs in the video. I was going to do another one, but um, the card got full. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, it's a really good keyboard. Um, the bundle is really good off gear for music. Um, so, yeah, if you're looking for a really nice, cheap, cheap, £300, I don't know, um, keyboard, then go with this one because it's got, I don't think I haven't said, it's got weighted keys. So it's like if you press it down lightly, <clears throat> then it does it quietly. If you press it down hard, then it does it loud. Um, so, yeah, that's going to be the end of this video. If you guys want to see more music sort of videos, then let me know in the comments. I'm going to be um, doing a video hopefully tomorrow because the guitar stand's coming tomorrow. So I'll be putting that up there in the corner. And um, so yeah, if you guys want to see more of these, let me know in the comments. I'll just like the video or whatever. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.